So this one we're going to be selecting a Google Doc and converting it and saving it into our Google Drive as a PDF document. And also we're able to specify the folder that we want to create the file within. Let's go ahead and create a doc. I've got a doc here that I've been using and I'm just going to create this one as a PDF within the drive. So we're going to set it up as within the root of the drive. So what we're going to need is we're going to need to have the ID of the doc. So whatever doc that you want to use, you can go ahead and you can create a brand new one. Go up to where the web URL is and this is where you can see the ID. Copy the ID out, bring it into the code. And here we're going to set the ID and we can actually set this globally. So this is one way that you can do this if you want to have multiple functions that are accessing the same sheet using its ID. We can just set it globally and have it independent of the function. So we're going to be generating a PDF and I'll call this function gen PDF. So first we need to select the document that we want to use, the ID. We're, we're getting the drive app get file by ID and then this is where we're selecting the ID of the file and that actually should be uppercase because we've set that as a global value so the variable name is ID as uppercase so once we've selected the actual document so this is the file that we want to select using its ID so we've opened that up within the doc as a doc value and now we can get the folder that we we can actually get the file as a PDF. So let's create the file as a PDF. So using that doc file that we just picked up and then get as, and then this is where we can specify the file type that we want to convert it into. And the file type that we want to convert it is going to be application PDF. And then where we want to do is we just want to create the file. So we can use the drive app and create file and just create the PDF. So what this will do is this is going to create it on the root. So let's go ahead and we're going to run the script. And now we see we've got the new file that's just been created. So let's say we want to open it up and have it within a folder. So I just created a brand new folder, grab the folder ID and we can create the new file within a specific folder by selecting its ID. So going back to here and set this up as another value that we can use. And this is going to be the folder ID. So if we want to set it within a specific folder, let's select the folder as an object. And this once again, we're using the drive app service where we're getting the folder by ID. And then we specify whatever the folder ID is. And that's going to be the one that we just grabbed. And now instead of setting just as the drive app going to the root, we can create the file within that particular folder. So let's try that again, where we're going to go back into the drive. And there's our new file that we've just created. And we also see that we still, that it's no longer being created within the root folder and just being created where we're specifying it. So if we were to remove those, and right now by default, it's just using whatever the name of the file is. And you can also specify the file name. So if you want to have a specific name for the file, so set that PDF, set name, and just give it whatever name you want. So let's try that again, where this time we've got, and we're setting up the name, specific names. So it's not using the default value it's setting up a name that we're able to specify within the code. So that's how you can create a PDF. That's really easy to do from the doc and also set it up within a specific folder, all using Google Apps Script.